Hey guys, it's Gay Gay. Welcome back to my channel. This is today's look. And I just call it my extra. Because <laughs> I love being extra. So if you're interested in how I did this look, just stay tuned, watch the video, hit like, hit subscribe, let's be people, and I hope you enjoy. All right, so we're going in with the Becca Primer. I need the cement today. Hey, hey, hey. So how are y'all doing? Everybody good? Is everything great? I hope so. And now I'm going in with this Becca, um, what do you call it? <laughs> Girl, I don't even know. Um, but yeah, I'll have it in the description if you care. Because I can't remember the name right now. But what it is, is it's a color corrector plus a, a eye brightener for up under these eyes. Because, you know, I don't get enough sleep. Ooh, and I can't even blame that on the Minkster. Because this is just insomnia. Uh, it, it's really horrible. So I'm going to try this up under my makeup and let's just see what happens hopefully it don't mess me up so we're back and like i'm gonna do my brows i'm using the l'oreal brow stylist definer you know okay so yeah let's try to get these brows to be um within the same family related blood relatives you know at the most we don't go for perfection because <laughs> that'll never happen over here we just go by look decent. Okay, so let's just go ahead and fill these in and do things. So what have y'all been doing? What's going on in your lives? What good things have been happening to you? That's what I want. Somebody tell me something good. Tell me some good things that's happening to you. Oh my God, are you serious? Hold on. Alrighty, so we're going to go in with this MAC Full Coverage Foundation, and I'm going to place it, place it, just work from the back of my hand and clean up these brows. And um, yeah, so what good things have been happening to you? Tell me, please, because honey, like I just had to take that call, and that was not good news at all about my mother. And so it's like, you know what? <laughs> I really need to hear some good things. I, I'm telling you the truth. I'm the type of person, and I don't know if it's many people like that or not, but I'm the type of person, even if it ain't happening to me, I like to hear about good news happening to other folks. Like, it's a girl on my Facebook page that, um, she's a makeup artist, a really good makeup artist, so I follow her. And um, I don't know her personally or anything. I just follow her work. And she's getting married. And I had went through the journey of her dating and everything and all. And I just got so happy when when she announced that she was getting married and, you know, showed her little ring and a part. Well, it wasn't little, but showed her ring and her um, engagement party and her soon-to-be groom. It was just, it was just nice. It was just nice to see see her happy like i don't know that woman from adam but i was just really happy <laughs> really happy for her, as if you know if we had went through the struggle together but i like that i want good things and nice things to happen to me so i gotta be happy for other people when it happened to them okay so as we can see we're not gonna have twins we're gonna have some type of relation they're gonna be blood relatives but they're not gonna be twins so we're gonna go with that because <laughs> over here <laughs> that's a good thing going in with this elf um concealer and i'm gonna use that as an eye base so yeah, so the lady was um, on her Facebook page and she was saying like, and she, I, I guess it, it had to be addressed because she said, and for people who are not happy for me, the haters, please don't make your comments. And I'm thinking, who in the world? Really? It don't make no difference. It's not your business. If that woman is happy, why can't you just be happy for her? Why would that woman even have to say it's like, oh my goodness, people that damn miserable. You know what? 
I got a lot of things going on in my life, just like other people do. It's no exception. I have a child that is I'm having to take care of and watch her slowly die right before my eyes. My mom is extremely sick any minute. It can, you know, it can be her last day, which can really be anybody's last day, healthy or sick, you know, whatever. But, you know, those things are pending. And if I can find joy and happiness and not be bitter and things, not to mention my life going to be totally turned upside down, you know, once my child is gone. <sighs> Why? Oh, my goodness. Do people just have to be so ugly and mean? And especially dating these days, honey, I'm single. So I know the struggle of the dating. Excuse me, let me get my powder because I need to set these eyes. I know the struggle. Honey, it is horrible. Horrible. I hate dating. Oh, I hate dating. It's horrible. I just hate going through all the clowns before you find somebody that's decent. And then usually what happens, either you don't really like them or they don't really like you. And it's like, ugh. Oh my goodness, are you serious? So golly, yes. I mean, how you can be happy for someone? I, it's just unbelievable. Okay, so we're gonna, uh, I think I'm gonna do a cat eye. That's what I think I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this cat eye. Guys, if I am too loud, I do apologize. I forgot I had this microphone right directly in my face and this thing picks up. Ooh, honey, we'll pick up the next street. Okay, so I'm going into the Zulu palette. Why are my eyes itching and watering? Oh my goodness, this can't be happening. And I'm gonna take this teal right here. Well, you know what? We're gonna do this look if we crying through it because uh, no, ma'am. Let me scoot up. I'm taking this teal right here and we're just gonna take this right in the inner corner. Oh, look at the fit. Oh my goodness, it's just so pretty. It's so pretty. Okay, so we're going to take this right in the inner corner right here. And I'm trying to place it also on that line that I drew. So, yeah, like I was saying, I know the struggle of dating. So, the fact that this woman has found someone, and she doesn't appear to be a, a person that's, you know, desperate or don't have no sense. So, you know, the fact that she found someone that, she feels like is, you know, really compliments her life and she enjoys that. It's just wonderful. I just thought that was just sad that the woman even had to make a comment about some people, you know. Oh, oh my goodness. So, yeah, let's just put that right there and we'll go on the other side and do that. So, yeah, we're taking this color all the way around over that cat eye trace. Come on now, come on, get on there and stop it. Stop it if you think you're gonna make a profit. Now, let's do the other. I can always do my right better than I can my left. I swear I'm a professional. I swear it. Okay, so yeah, let's get through with this. And what color are we going in with next? Oh yeah, this is gonna be a very bright <laughs> and colorful look, <laughs> in case you didn't know. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna go into this color here and I'm gonna place that. They're so similar. And see, that's why I wanted to place them close together because they are, but they're a little too similar. Yeah, so that is not what I want to do then. I think I ought to go back to the other colors because that's too similar. And I wanted it to be a little bit more different than that. So, yeah, we just going to have this um 
that's just how we're gonna get down. <laughs> we're just gonna get down like that. So I'm going back into that teal and I'm gonna just place it all over. I was gonna try to mix those colors, but if they're gonna be that similar, I might as well just use the teal. And I'm gonna place some black like right in there. We're gonna just try this out and see. I mean, if it don't work, what? It just don't work as makeup, you know what I'm saying? If it's not the prettiest look I've ever done, then it's just not the prettiest look, you know, it's makeup. Every day is not a winner. Okay, okay, okay. So let's go in on this eye and do the same. And of course, I'm sure I'll probably mix another color if I see one in there because that's what I do. But it's spring and it is such, well, it was such a pretty day. It was such a beautiful sunshiny day. So let's see. So I've been placing that one. I was just trying it out to see. It's got a lot of shimmer in it. I'm gonna go in with this matte. I'm gonna go in with this matte black and let's just place this here and see. If I don't like it, we can always put something else over it. Excuse that noise, that's the Minkster's machine. And so yeah, we'll just put this here and take this on up there and see. Go up, go up, go up, go up. Go up, okay. Okay, now let's kind of fill that in and clean it up. Because what I think I'm gonna end up having to do is maybe take this color here. It's got a little shimmer. It's a black, but it's got a, a shimmer in it. And you can kind of see that shimmer. Yeah. And I'll place that on top. Uh, no, I'm really not liking that. <laughs> That was not a good idea. Okay, Becky. Ooh, let's look at this. Look at this blue right here. What's that one about? What's that about? Let's just see. Since it's messed up anyway. Ooh, I don't know, but that's a pretty. Look at that. That's a pretty, pretty color. For another look anyway. Ooh. That would be real pretty on there. Yeah, I should have used that blue. I should have used this blue. Oh, maybe I can wipe that off now. Ooh, yeah, that would have been really pretty. Really different anyway. Mm, that's interesting. I look so pretty. Okay, so I just went over that black with the blue and just kind of mixing everything together because I didn't like it. I didn't like the black and then I didn't like the blue by itself. So I just kind of mixed the teal and the blue together. And um, yeah, that's how we're doing it. It's called cleaning up your mess ups. 
and that happens. And so what I'm gonna do now is take this green here and I'm just gonna place this right in the inner corner. Kind of brighten that up. Just like that. Just call me Aqua Girl, okay? Alrighty, so we're definitely going to do a liner with this because, girl, I created a hot mess. <laughs> and let's go ahead and clean up this eye, put some lashes on, and start on the face. So I'm just finishing up this eye, and what I'm doing is going in with this green, and I'm also going to make a little liner right here. Here, just a really light liner. And so what I'm I'm not gonna place my usual black cat eye. I'm just gonna use this shadow here as a liner. Yeah, and then we'll be through with the eye. And I'll throw on some lashes, and um, that's pretty much the eye. With this Charlotte Tilbury uh flawless filter. And let's just bronze, baby. Let's just bronze. Let's just get groovy, baby. Let's just get groovy. All righty. So we're going to go in with these Juvia's Place foundation sticks. And we are going to do our contour and foundation. That's what we doing. All right. The MAC um, Studio Fix, and I'm just gonna pour some on the back of my hand. I hadn't used this in a long time, but I need to start using this stuff up, so that's what we are gonna do. Okay, guys, and this is the completed look. I do hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit like, hit subscribe, let's be people, let's see each other weekly, play in makeup, comment, talk back and forth, and I hope you have a safe and happy weekend.